Hello my friends, today I tell you how to obtain the RPA Developer Advanced Certificate. In first place, you need to understand the theory. All the 45 equations are embedded in the UiPath courses from the UiPath Academy. But we have some help from the internet, from the other colleges, to try it to take the certificate. I tried 10 times until past this theoretical part. On the way, I collected several links to help me a lot. That links, I put the links in the description of this video. In the second part, um, we need build two projects, Dispatcher and Performer. In the Dispatcher, we fill queues on the orchestrator. And the Dispatcher take the queues with the details, and with the de details, go to the ACME website and take all their several details and fill an Excel file. Go with the first part. Here we need to build a project called Dispatcher. In this project we have three parts. In it, get transaction data and process transaction. In, in it, we collect the information from a config file and after we open a website a, an ACME website and authenticate and then we through to the options call it search for invoice in the second part get transition data go to the option that allows see all invoice here we have extract all invoice click and display all invoices and get that information into a variable call it out invoice invoice info go with the first part call it process transition in this part in process here we add that details at an existing queue what details here we are invoice number invoice item and total and what queue item that queue item put in the config file here invoices that that queue must be exist in the orchestrator let's see here it's the queue called invoice let's see it how it works dispatcher here it is where what's happened here the queue called invoice it's filled here it's all the data collected from the website go with the second part we need to build the project called performer that that project contains three parts in it get transition data and process transition similar the dispatcher project in init to collect the information from the config file and open the website ACME authenticate and get transition data here in get transition data XIML ok get transition data here get the information from the orchestrator queue the same information who that fill it in the dispatcher project in process transition through the process exam XI, XAML take the three details from the queue invoice number, invoice item and total and open, open a part of website with the in invoice number and extract extract invoice information take take other details from this web and collect to 
a das disable variable called extracted data table. With that information, when the process is finished, to collect in the Excel file. How? Look at, look at that main. Here, here is when the success. All right, here. Reporting record transition status. Reporting record transition status. Here is. Here is. And take. Here. Right range. And sheet one and A one. Intersection data. Here. Collect. In the Excel XML file. In Excel file the information with a status who what the status look at what the status put here is when success put success in other in, in other moment what happened is not success rule exception we put business rule error again what happened if uh, we have uh, error error normal what to collect system error now here we now let's hit how it works performer What is happening here? Take the information, invoice number, brand of tax ID, invoice item, total, and date, and put the information in an Excel file. the Excel file and here it's the list of here a business rule error we finish the challenge and put this that two projects put in the one folder and see that folder and upload to to web and get the certificate goodbye friends